nobody understands what Butch has gone through. He's going through a, a cancer issue. 21 days of chemo, seven days off. 21 days of chemo, seven days off for six years. That's Butch's life right now because he, had, he got a job-related cancer six years ago. We're trying, we're, our goal with this event is this, future-wise. future, future wise. Um, We're recognizing the opportunity uh, from a media standpoint to get the word out, uh, to help our community understand the additional dangers that firefighters are under, and that while it is a dangerous profession, this is one of the most dangerous elements in it, and the fact that it is actually taking the lives of our young firefighters. Um, so in that being said, our, our future goals and our future hopes with this event is to continue to grow it to the point that um, we would have more and more exposure on that level, but also be able to continue to raise funds for the organizations that are continuing to work um, annually to help us with our own awareness and our own education about the event. Long term, uh, long term goals are, 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 are out there, but certainly we'd love to see um, this have an impact on, at the state level because the, the state of Florida does not recognize cancer as a presumptive le legislation issue. We believe that through events like this and with us working together with multiple organizations, multiple departments, that we will have, um, we'll have that impact that's necessary to hopefully get uh, presumptive legislation in place for the state of Florida firefighters. This is my third year coming back for the All In for Firefighters. Uh, you know, obviously firefighters are considered our local heroes, so even though I live in California, the, the Palm Beach Kennel Club has been very kind to me and they have invited me to come back for a few times, so I'm just, it's just a wonderful honor to be here today. As letting the community know um, and uh, uh, even our fellow firefighters know, uh, creating awareness through uh, studies that we've had and through those studies and awareness it's also making changes all the way down into the, the, the firehouses and that's what's protecting our, our young people you know they're learning from our mistakes learning with the new knowledge and tools that they have to help prevent them from uh, facing the same thing because you know the odds are I mean it's a dangerous job anyway we don't need to add to it and uh, this has really, really gone a long way um, in uh, helping our brothers and sisters. Taking a stab at it. This is for Butch's goal and for our goal as a, as a fire service. It's going to be a continued goal is to let people understand, help them understand that the fire service, while dangerous, absolutely dangerous, is that much more dangerous because, because of the toxins that we're exposed to and the fact that, Palm Beach, that firefighters have a two to three more time likelihood of getting cancer than the general population? I mean, I, I think we're going to have a great turnout. You know, I, last year, I, like I said, last year we did pretty good, and I'm hoping that uh, this year will be even better. So, and hopefully we can keep the tradition going. And I appreciate that. I, I do appreciate your, your continued support, and we absolutely love having you as a face of this event. This event. I'm taking you down, I'm just saying it. <laughs> this is a rebuy tournament, so I should be hearing a lot of all in, followed by ship it. I look at it as a huge success. Unfortunately, too many of our fellow firefighters and brothers and sisters uh, are passing away from the epidemic in the fire service of cancer. And uh, I think we've made huge strides in education, and uh, we've, uh, we have a lot more knowledge today and uh, a lot more support through the Firefighter uh, Cancer Network, um, helping our, our future firefighters and uh, uh, that to come until we can get some legislation passed with the uh, state of Florida. Uh, the fact that everyone's here today is absolutely uh, a blessing and shows uh, how important this subject is. And uh, I'm very proud that uh, actually they use my name in, in this and that uh, uh, we're, we're making strides.